Hey guys, welcome to my Let's Play of Resident Evil 3. My name is Alex, and this is um, the PC version of the game. We're going to go with um, hard mode, and I'm going to pick uh, Costume 7, which is um, exclusive to the PC version. And I'll be quiet so you can watch the opening cutscene. Resident Evil It all began as an ordinary day in September. An ordinary day in Raccoon City. A city controlled by Umbrella. No one dared to oppose them. And that lack of strength would ultimately lead to their destruction. I suppose they had to suffer the consequences of their actions. But there would be no forgiveness. If only they had had the courage to fight. It's true that once the <coughs> of justice Sorry. begin to turn, nothing can stop them. Nothing. It was Raccoon City's last chance. And my last chance. My last escape. I've beaten this game dozens of times and I still love that intro. And welcome to Raccoon City. I'm gonna lure this zombie over to me. Try to bear with me because um, this cutscene is unskippable. September 28th, daylight. The monsters have overtaken the city. Suit yourself. 
That guy's name is um, Dario Rosso. He um, actually makes a cameo in a Resident Evil outbreak in the uh, Apple Inn of the uh, Hellfire scenario. He His name um, appears on the guest list of the inn. Pick up the first aid spray, Jill. Thank you. Uh, and I can't steer her very well today. This key um, will open the back door of this safe house. Now for um, this particular run, I've decided to uh, try and collect all the um, items uh, Nemesis drops when you uh, KO him. And to do that, we're going to need as much ammo as possible, and um, we need as many uh, health items too as possible. So we have to be very conservative in the um, opening 30 minutes for the uh, police station. I've always loved how this game starts. Um, you really get the sense that um, everybody else is dead and there's no one else to help you and um, that you're really on your own. And your only objective is um, just to get the hell out of here. Need to um, make sure I have as much inventory space as possible. And I'm going to go ahead and get the toothpick out, because that actually can come in handy um, in the first part of the game. I'm going to go ahead and put this away, because we're going to need it later. Okay, I think we're all set. If you listen closely, you can hear um, some zombie moaning outside. I've always thought that was creepy as hell. <laughs> 